But Eleanor Abraham is leading the way and looking for an absolute dominant performance here in 2024. At the 10 minute mark, Abraham breaking into a full sprint. Her top time, 10, 15, 20. Abraham crosses the finish line with a new meet record at 10, 10, 03. She knew she was close, kicked it into an extra gear. All smiles, the two mids embrace. Keeney creating distance, kicking it into an extra gear, and the Navy mid is going to finish strong here for gold. What a performance. He sets a new me and facility record. Again, Bramir Vic looking to defend his title. He is in the middle of your screen. Vic with a good lead early on, has a couple more hurdles to clear. Final one towards the finish line and Vic will defend his championship. Right now, Navy leading the way to the anchor, Gia Anderson out of Delaware. Navy, Army fighting for gold. Army taking it with Sophia Dykstra, who will come out on top. And the official result has Navy right now at 46-14. Army comes in at 46-14 by one thousandth of a second behind Navy. And there's another look at that photo finish. Home stretch here. Can Kent knock off his teammate Guillaume? Guillaume trying to kick it into an extra gear. Kent might have enough though in the tank. And Kent will take down his teammate with a winning time of 47-26. Is off and running. Posted the best time yesterday. Looking for a gold medal here on her home track. May you gate in giving her a run for her money. That is a close finish, folks, as they go the other way. And it is May you gate in winning it at 11.68, outlasting Quinn of Bucknell at 11.72, and Emma Taylor of Army will take home the bronze. The defending champion with a good lead, making it look easy. Brian Matthews trying to track him down of Army. Late push by the Black Knight, but it will not be enough, and it's a new meet record for Guillaume. Guevara Cragwell in second currently with the best jump of 46 feet and one and a half inches. As Allen is trying to cement himself atop here in the standings for the men's triple jump. Around the turn, and here comes Lemelin of Navy. And the Navy Blue looking to defend her title. She takes the lead. On the outside, Haley Murphy still holding strong. Battle for second, and now Grace Kennedy of Lehigh. Levelin will repeat as champion the 400 with a time of 1006. Updated standings here on the live stats. You've got Navy leading on both the men and women's side. Kent, the two sport athlete for Navy in lane four, looking to win another title. It would be his second in as many years as the sophomore has the lead. And he is going to win in dominant fashion with a new facility record at 20.98. Kirkland pushing down the stretch. And it will be Navy winning the gold, a new facility record by Alexander Kirkland, 13.56.64. Army trying to make the pass with Elegon. Navy 
down the home stretch looking to repeat. Woodworth holding on and it looks like the mids will in fact repeat as the four by four champions. Kent needs to push it. Grinder giving it all he has and it will just be short and Kent comes up hobbling. Navy on the men's side will capture their 10th consecutive outdoor track and field championship. Army will take home silver with an even 200. BU with over 100 points, they will finish third. Bucknell on their home course finishes fourth and Holy Cross a fifth place finish for the Crusaders at 48 and a half points. On the women's side, Navy again, they're able to clinch their sixth straight title. Army will settle for second.